All right, this is a short video, uh, mostly for my friend Noah, who wanted to know how to do curtains in the car. So I have these things right here. Um, it's called a button snap. Um, they're quite expensive, actually. Uh, it's two parts. So this is one part here. Um, the other part is the actual button, like this. It snaps on there, um, like that. Uh, but to be honest, you don't you don't really need that. Um, so what I've done is uh, rigged up a cord. So I've got a, a cord here that's screwed in with this, which is a button snap. You could use a regular screw, it's fine. Um, anyway, that cord runs up, uh, not all the way to the front. Uh, let me show you. Runs up to basically the, what they call the B pillar on the car. Um, and I have it screwed in there as well. Same thing on the other side, all the way back. So then what I did was I screwed, if you can see this, um, this is a, a towel that I got from Target yesterday actually, and this material works really good because it's really thick and it's really durable. Um, so I've got one part of it screwed at the bottom, one part of it screwed at the top, and then up here what I have is a clip, and I got these from Home Depot, it's like 57 cents each. And basically you pull that kind of like a curtain rod I guess um, I don't know how you can see this but anyway it slides all the way down and basically once it gets to the end here what I'll do is take that clip off and actually clip it to the cord itself um, so that way it gets a little uh, it gets more tension you know it pulls it all the way up here um, and then I have a clip here in the center as well that I'll clip uh, let me show you what that looks like too actually so this is another button clip um, but it's not screwed in all the way so I just bring this towel up here put it around that and then clip it on the outside just like that pretty simple um, so that's how that works and for the back um, I actually have a piece of cloth that I made up and I have a, a button on each corner you can see them kind of here, one here, and one there. Um, one on all four corners. And then what I do is, uh, when the back door is shut, I have the top piece it hooks there, and the bottom piece hooks here. And that basically cuts out most, of, almost all the light. The, like I said, the the towels are extremely dark, which is nice. Um, for the front, uh, the cord that I have here, that I have attached. I just basically clip one end of a towel, string it across here, and then clip the other end there. And that basically gives me four walls, if you want to call it that. Um, as far as the sleeping goes, um, this is just a regular piece of foam, like the crate foam. It's really hard to see. There we go. Um, regular piece of crate foam, folded in half because I don't need it. And this is a, I think a full size is 57 inches. So folded in half, it's a little over 25. My sleeping pad is 20 inches wide. So you can see it's a little bit wider. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, super simple setup. Uh, it's kind of a, I guess that's a third, third generation setup. Um, third time I've done it in a car. And seems to be working pretty good. So hope that helps. Peace.